Hi, I'm Sam. Today, we're gonna make a confetti cannon. Let's make! I thought it would be really fun to try and make an air cannon for under $5. So, we're going to use a old pop bottle, a valve, and a piece of PVC. If this is the type of content that you like, be sure to scroll down, press that subscribe button, and ring that little bell icon. I upload a new video every Monday at noon, and I'd love to see you there. With that being said, let's get right into this build. All you need to do to prepare the bottle is to remove this little ring. I then measured how high up the threads go on the valve and marked it. Drilling a small pilot hole will help ensure that when I move up to a larger drill bit, it'll go in easier and it won't crack the pipe. I then threaded the hole that I made and inserted a fill valve. I used hot glue here to ensure a strong bond. You don't have to use hot glue, in fact you can even use duct tape. You just want to make sure that no air can escape out of that little crack. Here we're just bonding the pipes using pipe cement. One thing to note while you are bonding the pipes is to twist it a little bit as it goes in. This will ensure a really strong seal. The most important part of this build is the sticker to give it that little extra flair. This seriously took me 10 minutes to make and I am thrilled with how it came out. So there you go. It's as easy as that. This literally cost under $5. Soda was like $1.20, this was a dollar, and this was a dollar. That is insane. Obviously you can use a bicycle pump, but all you do is hook it on, fill. Help if I closed it. I'm only comfortable getting the soda bottle to about 20 PSI. I don't know how much more it can take outside of that. But once that is done, all you do is, and you have a little air cannon. So let's bust out the confetti. All I could find was gender reveal confetti. So that's what we're gonna use. This is going to be everywhere. So I hope you all appreciate what I am doing. Okay. We're just gonna use a pencil to jam it down a little bit further. Then we fill with air. Like I said, around 20 PSI is really all I feel comfortable filling this to. And then we have That's actually pretty cool. I do have one other little surprise for you guys. So I think we're gonna have to move outside and show off just how cool this thing can be. Three, two, one. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> oh my God, that's so cool. All right, same thing as before. Three. Two, one. <laughs> it's so cool. So there you have it. For $5 in about 10 minutes, you can make a pretty awesome air cannon. You can use this to shoot more than just confetti or chalk dust. You could also use it to shoot out some fake blood if you're going for that kind of effect or really just anything that you can imagine. And I am really happy with how this came out. It is going to be fun. I'm sure I'll find some use for it in the future. Other than that, if you like this video, don't forget to scroll down, press that subscribe button, ring that little bell icon, and give me a thumbs up while you're down there. Leave me some ideas of what you think it would be fun to shoot out of this thing. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video.